Hopkins is an amazing university and Homewood is a beautiful campus. But what many students don't know is how much the city of Baltimore has to offer. I'm Lucy. And I'm Noah. We're students at the Johns Hopkins University in Baltimore, Maryland. And we're here to help you learn, learn more, more, see more, be more. more. Just a few miles up North Charles Street lies Towson, home of Goucher College, Towson University, and one of Baltimore's largest shopping areas. This area is home to the largest indoor mall in Baltimore County, a popular concert venue for local and national artists, and the Towson Marketplace, a shopping center that houses such major retailers as Walmart, Target, and Bed Bath & Beyond, among others. In Towson, there are a number of historic pubs and famous eateries, such as the Green Turtle and the Melting Pot. There's always so much happening here. As we were walking around, we stumbled upon a street fair with food vendors, live outdoor music, games and raffles, and a large red bouncy castle for ages 12 and under. Which of course, we are at heart. Mount Vernon has some of the most charming and well-preserved 19th century architecture and monuments on the east coast of the United States. There are a number of theaters and concert halls, such as the Lyric Opera House, Center Stage, the National Jazz Institute, and the Joseph Meyerhoff Symphony Hall, home of the Baltimore Symphony Orchestra. Mount Vernon has a very warm and welcoming atmosphere, with a number of small parks, cafes, and interesting historical sites. This residential neighborhood is characterized by vintage row houses and beautiful landmarks, such as the Mount Vernon Methodist Church. The Peabody Institute lies in the center of Mount Vernon and is easily accessible through a number of free transportation services, including the Charm City Circulator and the Johns Hopkins Shuttle, both of which pick up and drop off in front of Baltimore's Washington Monument, which in fact predates the Washington Monument in D.C. Hamden, the neighborhood commonly referred to as JHU's Backyard, encompasses a wide variety of cafes, shops, and art galleries. This neighborhood is known for its music and art scene. In fact, after our visit to the skate park, we ran into my comedy a cappella group, the JHU Mental Notes, and we decided to sing a song on the streets of Hamden.
Thanks for watching part two of our Neighborhoods of Baltimore episode. There's so many other great neighborhoods in Baltimore to visit, but we're finally back at Homewood. Be sure to come explore this campus for yourself and join us next time to learn more, see more, be, be more. <laughs>